everybody. Welcome to Franny Square and to a flash review of Hobby Lobby's Fundamental Cotton. Okay, so if you saw my last tutorial on the boho belt, you know that I used Hobby Lobby's Fundamental Cotton Yarn. And I said I'd be putting out a flash review after I used the yarn. So here it is. Let's talk about the yarn. It comes in 100 gram skeins and it has 164 yards or 150 meters. It's 100% mercerized cotton. And if you haven't heard of mercerized cotton, all it is is cotton that's gone through a process that makes it stronger, it makes it absorb dye better so your colors can be more vibrant and your colors actually last longer through washings. It's often a shinier yarn than just a plain 100% unmercerized cotton. Now mercerized cotton is not as absorbent as unmercerized cotton, so you're gonna choose your cotton based on the function that you wanna use it for. Since I was making a belt, I wanted something stronger, something with a little bit of shine. So this was perfect for my purpose. The fundamental cotton is a four weight yarn. So you can see it here and it's twisted. You can see that it's a nice tight twist and you can see the shine on it as well. The regular price for this yarn is $4.99. Hobby Lobby has sales every so often. I know some people have said it's every other week. I can't guarantee that it's every other week but they have sales where their yarn is 30% off. I bought this yarn during that sale, so I paid $3.49 for this skein of yarn. I tried comparing the price of this to other yarns. I looked up 100% mercerized cotton, four weight yarns, didn't find anything. I did find Lamia, which is a three weight mercerized cotton yarn by Hobium, and I actually have some in my yarn closet. And price-wise, it's pretty comparable. The 50 gram skein of Lamia is $1.80. So if you got 100 grams, it'd be $3.60. So it's comparable to the sale price of this. You do get more yardage in the Lamia because it is a three weight rather than a four weight. As far as color selection goes, I'm gonna show you the colors here. There's only eight of them for the fundamental cotton. So you don't get a lot of selection. They do have neutrals. They have a white, they have this camel color, they have a gray, they have a black, and then they have something called spice, a red, I believe, a green and a blue. So not a big selection color wise, but they did have what I was looking for. And I do have the white here as well. So you can see that it's, it's a white, white, very white. As far as softness goes, this isn't a particularly soft yarn, but I wasn't looking for a soft yarn, which brings up a good point. When I do flash reviews, I rate softness. So take that into account when you're looking at my final rating of Franny Squares, because I'm giving higher ratings for the softness of the yarn. But in this case, I wasn't looking for the yarn to be soft. I wanted it to have a little bit more structure because I'm making a belt and a bag out of it. And so softness was not one of the criteria. So when you're listening to these reviews, it's important to take into account the qualities that you're looking for your specific project. So again, I was looking for something stronger, not necessarily soft. For example, if I was using Trubu yarn, I don't know that I would like that for a belt. It's so soft and so drapey, it wouldn't have enough structure for me. So, as I said, this is not particularly soft. It's not scratchy or harsh. You could definitely put it against your skin. It's just not what I would call really soft. I'd say it's middle of the road. As far as ease of use goes, this was so easy to use. It does not split at all. It slips right off the hook, gives great stitch definition. I'll show you here again on the belt. Um, gave me nice structure to my belt pleasure to work with. So for my overall rating for Hobby Lobby's Yarn Bee Fundamental Cotton Yarn, for price, I give it a three. I say it's middle of the road compared to what I've seen out there, especially if you get it on sale. For color selection, I give it a one. It only has eight colors. There's not a huge selection. 
For softness, I give it a three. It's middle of the road. It's not really soft. It's not harsh and scratchy. And for ease of use, I give it a five. It is so easy to work with. It's a pleasure and I'm looking forward to doing that bag that I'm designing. So my overall rating for Hobby Lobby's Yarn Bee Fundamental Cotton Yarn is 3.0 Franny Squares. A nice middle of the road yarn, perfect for belts, hats, and handbags. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you've worked with Hobby Lobby's Fundamental Cotton Yarn, I'd love to hear about your experience with the yarn. As always, thank you so much for joining me. I truly appreciate it. Remember to make it your own and I'll see you soon.